All right, Shalom, this is Gamali Ali out of Great Millstone, Atlanta. I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai, Bashim, Rakakudash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. Shalom to all the Akim that pushing out the truth and sincerity. All right, coming at you with a quick lesson. All right, and um, this is going to be uh, concerning this whole uh, pestilence. All right, in China, you got uh, what's called the coronavirus. All right, and um, this thing is um, heating up, man. You know, uh, we've been saying it uh, for a while now. You know that that there that there will be a uh, another major outbreak. Okay, um, you know, there's been um, Ebola. Um, what's that other one? H one N one. I mean, you've had so many over the years, and sometimes they subside. You know, they'll they'll diminish. But uh, this coronavirus looks like it's the real deal. All right, it's, it lo it's looking like um, you know it, it's going to uh, be the next major uh, thing. All right. So uh, this is on uh, RT.com. Uh, this is the latest update on the coronavirus. It says mass and airport checks for Chinese SARS-like virus are there to keep population calm. No government can stop its spread now. And that's the point that I kind of wanted to also touch on is they said that no government can really stop it right now. All right, yeah, because why can no government stop it? It's because it's ordained by the Heavenly Father. Okay, Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, all right, is, is the orchestrator. Uh, matter of fact, let's get... Man, um, Let's get that Isaiah. Isaiah 45 and 7. I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, do all these things. All right. So uh, the point being that <laughs> this is this not an evil thing, you know, uh, um, you know, a, a deadly virus that can wipe out millions potentially. All right, you know the Lord creates evil. Okay, He creates, you know these these different um, deadly viruses. All right. Anyway, I'll read it. It says um, Peter Andrews is an Irish science journalist and writer based in London. He has a background in life sciences and graduated from University of Glasgow. As the Chinese coronavirus spreads rapidly around the globe. Governments worldwide are making a show of doing something, but are their measures effective or just exercises in population control? On Wednesday, the World Health Organization deliberated on whether to declare the disease an international public health emergency, postponing the decision for a lack of clear data. All right, which, I mean, this is right now, it is an international thing. It's international um, public emergency because it's starting to spread and I believe um, they're saying it spread to Texas and also Washington all right um, listen to this though this is a uh, martial law and matter of fact I'll, I'll keep reading it says prior to Monday the only known cases of the virus were all from people who had been in Wuhan suggesting they all caught it at the illegal wildfire market thought to be ground zero for the plague as the virus has an animal origin it was hoped it was hoped at first that it could only jump from animal source to humans but now we know the virus can be transmitted from person to person things look much bleaker in the last few days the virus has spread to taiwan and there has been one confirmed case in seattle Screening efforts are to be stepped up by Australia, Russia, and UK passengers arriving from Wuhan. All right, let's see. Martial law coming to Wuhan. China's National Commissioner, Vice Minister Li Bin, has told people not to enter or exit the city of Wuhan, but this means little, little unless it is enforced. Reporters from Wuhan itself has been scarce, so it is difficult to gauge the mood on ground, on the ground there. 
All right. Um, Mr. Lee has had to admit the virus is contagious by respiratory tract. In other words, coughs and sneezes. This is the easiest way for the for a virus to spread, and there is practically nothing that can be done to slow or stop it. All right. Hand sanitizers and face masks will never be ubiquitous. And in any case, do they even work? All right. So, um, so as you see, you know, um, <laughs> this thing is spreading, man. And, um, you know, I believe that this is a plague sent by the Lord. Well, really, every plague is sent by the Lord. But, you know, um, as far as, um, you know, the, the, the severity of it, okay, it, it can vary, that can vary, all right, but this thing seems pretty severe, and um, Lord willing, it grows, man, Lord, Lord willing, man, this is, this is the, uh, the virus of all viruses, <laughs> you know, uh, here's another one that says, uh, China coronavirus Infections soar to 830 with 26 deaths. As World Health Organization says, it's too early to declare global emergency. All right. Um, let's see. Um, I want to get into... Because this is all just pestilence. All right. Um... Amos 4 and 10, I have I have sent among you the pestilence after the matter, manner of Egypt. Your young men have I slain with the sword and have taken away your horses, and I have made the stink of your camps to come up with your nostrils, yet ye have not returned unto me, saith the Lord. All right? So the Lord has sent like the Lord has sent a pestilence. After the manner of Egypt, which we know exactly what happened to Egypt, all right. You know, um, I'm gonna get another one. This is uh, I got the one already. Let's get um, Ezekiel five and eleven. Wherefore, as I live, saith the Lord Yahweh, surely because thou hast defied, defiled my sanctuary with all thy detestable things and with all thine abomination therefore will i also diminish thee neither shall mine eyes spare neither will i have any pity yes yeah, so the lord is getting ready to wreak havoc on the earth let's get a uh, matthew 10 and 24 matthew 10 of uh no that's not it uh i'm looking for this Thirty four, Matthew ten and thirty four. Think not that I am come to send peace. Think not that I am come to send peace on earth. I came not to send peace, but a sword. Okay, and and part of the Lord's sword is is one of the instruments of the Lord. Sword, the Lord's um, sword is is through pestilence. Okay, a sword is just an instrument to to bring death. And one of the instruments the Lord uses to bring death is pestilence. So let's get this word pestilence. Um, debar. Debar. It says marine, cattle disease, cattle plague. Okay. So let's go back to the article. It says, The World Health Organization held out designating a few uh, a new fast-spreading coronavirus as an intentional health threat, but did deem it as a crisis within China, where the pathogen has, been, has infected some 830 people and killed 26. And there was a, um, there was a video also, if, if, if you uh, look it up, uh, you see a person with coronavirus, man, they just drop dead, man. It, 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 you know, it seems like that thing, 
you know, it immediately kills you. You know, it spreads very, very fast. Now, patient zero, um, probably more than likely got the virus from, from eating bat soup. All right, did patient zero really catch new Chinese virus by eating infected bat soup? It's all right, uh, let's read on. It says, Yeah, and these heathens, that's that's what go to show you that they got they need slavery, okay? Because <laughs> what the hell are you doing eating fucking bat soup, man? That shit is way off, man, you know. That's not something that you should be ingesting. So, of course, you're going to get sick. All right. Oh, it says. Um, it says, um, let's not forget bats are reservoirs for more than 60 viruses. So watch this. Let's watch this video. Yeah, so you see that? That's disgusting, man. These these Chinese people, they eat any damn thing, man. You know? And they're not, you know, they don't, they don't, that goes to show you they don't have no order, man. That's why, that's why we got to get back. That's why Israel has to be put back in order to to show them how to live properly, man. Show them how to eat properly. It says the images have to be seen to be believed. They appear to show the full body of a small black bat, leathery wings and all, perched in a dish of brown liquid and leering like a vampire in disguise. One video shows a girl putting the creature whole in her mouth as she dines with her friends, but it looks like bats may have the last have had the last laugh. Okay. So that was it on that. Now I want to get um. Let's get a couple more. The sword is without. This is Ezekiel seven and fifteen. The sword is without, and the pestilence and famine within. He that is in the field shall die with the sword, and he that is in the city, famine and pestilence shall devour him. Yeah, so, you know, pestilence is a city thing, man. You don't have to really worry about pestilence if you're out there in um in the uh the in a rural area, okay? These these pestilences are going to they're going to um you know, hit major cities, man, and they're going to spread quick. All right, and the Lord is going to start revving up if if this coronavirus isn't isn't the pet, the the main pestilence then best believe there's going to be more to look forward to. I right, best believe there's going to be a very heavy, heavy one coming soon. Says so China shuts down more cities in bid to contain de deadly virus. China decided Thursday to lock down three cities that are home to more than 18 million people in an unprecedented effort to try to contain a deadly new vi viral virus that is sick in hundreds and spread to other cities and countries in the Lunar New Year travel rush. Okay. It says police SWAT teams and paramilitary troops guarded Wuhan train station where metal barriers blocked the entrance entrances at, at 10 p.m. sharp, 10 a.m. sharp. Only travelers holding tickets for the last trains were allowed to enter with those booked for later tra trains being turned away. All right. It says... Uh, well, that was pretty much the point, but as you see, okay, man, this thing is heating up these, these pestilences, uh, the Lord is bringing plagues, okay, um, and, you know, we want more, you know, we, we're, we're praying that there's more judgment, Ezekiel 28 and 23, for I will send into her pestilence and blood into her streets and the wounded shall be judged in the midst of the streets by the sword upon her on every side and they shall know that I am the Lord now this when you read up this is talking about Zidon 
which I believe was an Edomite um, city in ancient times. All right, but um, we know that plagues, the Lord will use plagues in any day and age. All right, so this applies to today as well, not just you know back then. Okay, because that's one thing that the Lord do, does is He sends plagues. All right, so um, you know that's pretty much the point. Lord willing, really we're edified. Just wanted to bring that out on the coronavirus, just coronavirus update. Uh, leaving off by giving all praise to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh Shai, Bashim, Kakudash, double honors to the elders and apostles of the great millstone. Shalom.